the King Burns Cola Wars after these messages. Hello, is you worried about big shadowy companies stealing all your personal data? You should be. Do you want to stop companies from stealing all your personal data? Tough, you can't. Yeah, you bond. You can't stop them, but you can make them regret it. Yeah. It, Argle and Bargle Data Poisoning Service. We take your real data, mingle it with highest quality lies, half-truths and other fabrications to make useless pile of random noise not even SETI can find signal in. Bad credit, good credit, no credit, you get all these at once. Plus, credit appearances on TV shows from before you were born. Sure, you're not able to buy a house, but they're not in cards anyway. Yeah, now you have hard drive full of weird porn, but just think of what chaos that do to Twitter and Facebook algorithms. Not illegal stuff. Not illegal stuff. Just questionable stuff. Uncomfortable stuff. What wrong with you stuff? Stuff like... Data Poisoning Service. Because why not take everyone else down with you? Well, I've seen worse ideas out of the tech sector. This month. And speaking of worse ideas... Produced by old people. Okay, who wants to bet against this being a magical dream visitor fire hoses a kid with conformity message type deal? Uh, I'm good, thanks. I am Centron, and I'm pretty sure I've used this joke in a previous riff. Andy! Stop Bye. mad dunking on that sad boy. His fragile yeah, ego can't take it. Tomorrow, I'm going to Mary's party tomorrow, aren't you? A party? Why, I didn't even... No, I don't like parties. I never have any fun at parties. Well, well since that clown you exploded. Parties are more fun when all your friends are there. Cindy! Well, I better go. I'll see you. Here's your ball. I must return to the regeneration tanks. Why didn't they invite me? Was it my breath? Because I melted now Mary's bike on a dare? Maybe it was busting her dad for tax evasion. Guess I'll never know. Mother, why do you suppose Mary didn't invite me to her party? Well, you Pretty did implicate sure her in the Black Dahlia case. Maybe they thought I wouldn't want to go to a party. They probably thought I wouldn't know how to act. Hey, yeah. Mary, <gasps> your name Mom's is Cindy, a not Cinderella. You will get an invitation to the party. As soon as I destroy He-Man! <laughs> Wait and see. Oh, it's not important anyhow. Good night, Slender Mom. Good night, Mother. Good night, Cindy. Good night, my precious... Yep, called it. Your name's Cindy, not Cinderella. And you're made from you pumice. You go to the party. You go to the party. Yule Brenner is going. You, Cindy, are staying home. Cindy! Wake up, Cindy! I'm what? woke as f Who's there? I don't see anybody. Of course you didn't. I'm not just anybody. I'm, I'm the Black Dahlia! Godmother. Sure. You don't believe me? Well, that's up to you. I just thought you might want to go to that party. Oh, I do, I do. We that Mary needs a new mud hole stop dinner. Ready. Oh, but I wasn't invited to the party. They probably thought I'd rather play basketball or go fishing or... Well, you've been invited, all right. I've seen to that. Now, and put I'm on the class you. president's skin. I didn't tell anyone. Not even Dennis? Well, maybe we'd better tell Dennis. I have a feeling he's going to need my help, too. I've got a Pretty pair of shoes that'll make. make him dance till he dies. Oh, until this afternoon. It is this afternoon. I had a doctor's oh, appointment this morning, you bitch. Oh, what a mess. Oh, Sit and spin, you prancing pinhead. Magic wand. Ready? 
Huh. Oh, but this isn't my very best dress. Oh, now look. You're not going to the party to show off your clothes. You're going to rob the blind. Clean? She's a calligramancer. And neat when you go to the party. <sighs> we better hurry now. We don't want to be late. I gotta drag Ready? three of you Rugrats back to Arcadia and I'm not getting stuck with leftovers. Here we are. Oh, you know, I think this is Mr. B. Natural's here. mom. I hate to be the first one. I don't blame you. No one likes to sit and wait for a party to start. Oh, or party maybe it's Pink's mom. Really get going until everyone arrives. So whenever you go to a party, Cindy always... Bathe! For Be crying out loud. And when the clock says it's time to go home... Be sure to leave on time. That's important. Well, you hear that? Shoppers have come in two minutes before it. the store closes? But you can spoil the fun of a party if you try to make it last too long. So a hundred years is okay, though. Bored. Come on, Dad. Oh, look. Here comes some of the others now. Whew, I was prepared to wait hours out here not to be first. Hi, Cindy, who are you talking to? Oh, no, and I was just thinking out loud, I guess. These kids are going to get picked off like it's Camp Crystal Lake. Cindy. Eh, you got into the quaaludes again. I thought you weren't coming to the party. I wasn't, but you'll see her, then you'll understand. Run, kid! Once you see them, they can see you! Ah, Pistler's mother. What? Response time. 2.7 epochs. You are? Certainly. See, they're setting up for a game of musical chairs. Ah, oh, but I don't like to... Did I say you there. could talk? That's Your ass belongs to me, male mayonnaise. <laughs> Join in the game. A party calls for teamwork. Why, nobody will have any fun unless everyone joins in. So join in wholeheartedly in any game suggested. Abandon your personal desires and meld with the hive mind. You spin me right round, baby, right round, like a record. So, uh, you think this is the fairy version of community service? Oops. Remember now. Don't be too noisy or rough. And don't break things. It's gonna be real Thanks. awkward when they bring yeah, out the you pinata. Yeah, you're too. You're out of the game. That's what you get for bumping into things. Oh, she's only kidding. I know. I'm just a tight-ass killjoy. Don't tease or make fun of others. Not even your very best friends. They might not understand. It's not like you're going to need to practice that kind of interaction to fit in with society or anything. you would have any fun. Mumble, All right, bad godmother. Uh-oh, the music's starting. What do I do? Why, just what you have been doing. Drooling and staring into the middle distance. the game and... Be a good loser. Well, he's got plenty come of practice. Stand out. Come on, Cindy. Come on, Cindy. Come on, Cindy. It's a tie. Hey, that was fun. Actually, you won. Sure she did. But here, Cindy, you show him what I whispered in your ear. Just Don't you dare call the cops or... No, not that! Be a good winner. And she was. See how much fun it is when you join in the games in the right way? I just hope I can remember the right ways you've shown us. That's it took easy. me an hour just to remember, remember how pants manners. work. Be polite. And above all, be considerate of others. So have fun together. Hey, who Ready? wouldn't have fun knowing their every move is being judged by a reality-bending specter? What? Oh, now this party officially blows. She's just sitting on the bell and waiting. Whoa! Oh, no! They're like eight! No! Lady, you're a freak! Ha 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 ha! Oh god, what did I just touch? Yeah, well, tough. Here, Cindy. Here, Dennis. Thanks, Mary. Here I am. Oh shit, I'm great, great! I bet I know what you were gonna tell us. Remember our table manners when eating. Oh, now you spoiled my fun. Now oh, satiate me with a bowl of cream, or I'll bring now every pup into life for 30 cream. miles around. Oh, you've been a big help, fairy godmother. I've enjoyed the party, so go ahead and write it for us if you want to. Sure, we want you to write it for us. You if you're going to be a damn yeah. martyr over it. Remember your table manners. You didn't really need my help. Did you shampoo your hair or just lacquer it? Guess you don't need me anymore. 
I may as well be going. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Stop. Don't you come see back. You can't unless you need them. And you don't need me anymore. But you will remember to leave on time, won't you? Yeah, speaking of leaving. To thank the hostess. And whenever we go to any more parties, we'll remember to be clean and neat and to be on time. And we'll Leave. be considerate of others, too. We'll join in the games. Leave. And to obey the rules. And make fun for everybody, not fun of anybody. Or be hey, too Cindy, noisy too Dennis, rough. why are you talking to the fireplace, you weirdos? You'll always have fun, then. Because parties are fun when everyone is considerate of others. Wow, we've actually found a fairy Goodbye more annoying now. than Navi. Don't go. Don't go. Don't I go. really want to be go. your friend. Don't go. Don't go. Wake up, Cindy. Oh, God, I'm in oh, hell. Oh, I'm it's just, just you, Mom. <gasps> Cindy, here's Mary's sister, Nancy. She just came by to tell you that she was supposed to deliver your invitation to Mary's party three days ago. But she forgot. She so speaks not nice for I'm taking her turn. <sighs> Oh, yes. Oh, thank you. Thank you so much. Enjoy the silent, penetrating stare of this phantasm from your sleeping mind. Young America Films. Obey and conform. Consume. Bye. Yield. So here's a thought to hang a closing sketch on. What's with all the dreams in these shorts? Pop culture. That all you got? Allow me to exfoliate. <sighs> Yeah. Oh, yeah. And now, allow me to elucidate. Three words, the Wizard of Oz. Four words, Wizard of Oz. Four words, the Wizard of Oz. That movie would still be very heavy in the pop culture consciousness of the 1950s. And when something's popular, it's gonna get imitators. It set the pattern for kids having mystical learning adventures and dreams, where reality and dream blend in unsettling ways. Eh, I can see that. So that, maybe it's a wonderful life? Eh, not really. That one's really a pop culture thing now, primarily due to being used as holiday airtime filler throughout the 1970s. That film didn't do well at all on initial release, critical-like or financial-like. It just kind of got jackhammered into our collective subconscious through sheer banal repetition. Intriguing. Lies and thunder. The dreams of Fiddy Short Flim Flams is all elaborate. Conspiracy, of course it is. You're darn Putin it is. And that's the A1 sauce in my new series, Unhinged Mysteries. The truth will set you table. We're really letting the side characters go to town this episode, aren't we? Eh, let them have this. It keeps them off the streets, at least. As it transpires, this fairy godmother is but a mere soldier in a top-secret squad of elite morality dream warriors, led by none other than Soapy the Germ Fighter. Dems and the talking cars enter your headspaces through the corn syrups we eat, all to lure us into complacency and subsequiousness, teaching children to place their trust in creatures that enter their dreams to provide advice at the behest of their masters, Frito-Lay! They're after the flavor combinations of your dreams! I mean, do you want this guy out in the streets? No, but I don't want him in my closet either! But these evil monkeys can be stopped thanks to my new sponsor! Sponsor? I thought you said money was a tool of big zinc! That's true and more! Thus we now accept cryptid currencies! You mean cryptocurrencies? Says the guy who often misuses words himself? I know what I slurred. We accept cryptid currencies, like squirrel jerky, the stock barter of good of Bigfoots. And like the Bigfoots, you can keep your vital thoughts secure and turgid with a daily dose of Skull Power Gamma, the new triple action fluoride pill, because the fluoridization water was a double bluff, now with vitamin lead! But now they're on to me, so I must away to my safe house in the dumpster behind the quick trip where they're about to dispatch the day-old breakfast burritos, which I need to keep my force shields active. Okie dokie. Alright, where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh. You. Um. You keeping safe? Yes. Good, good, yeah, yeah, well. 
Um, so... Target lost. Call off Strike Force Sudsy. Repeat. Call off Strike Force Sudsy. Nothing. So... Bye. I win the gas! Hey Pipples, if you liked our nonsense, want to give us a like, or a subscribe, or leave a comment down there somewhere. You can also do us a big solid by joining our Patreon, where you'll get to join us for live streams, get early access to the newest videos, and other such things. Geek Vision. Not illegal stuff, no. What am laws really, anyway? Well, I've seen worse ideas out of the tech cent cent center center sector center. Uma Oprah.